Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. Before I start the video, I would like to introduce my friend Kylie, Hi. and she's really good in doing hair. She even has an Instagram account dedicated to different hairstyles that you can follow. Be sure to check it out. Um, as you can see, we're both in our old school uniforms today because we'll be doing a back. cute back to school, <laughs> cute, cute back, back to school, school hairstyle style. video. Sorry. Sorry, Kylie. Cute back, back to school, school hairstyles video. Yay! Yeah. Without further ado, let's get to it. Number one. So first, you take a strand of hair. Make sure you put aside deep parting. Then this strand, you divide this strand of hair. You divide it into three strands of hair. Much big, you put the first strand of hair underneath the middle piece, and then the last strand underneath the middle piece. Can you see it? So I'll repeat again. So you put in hair for the first piece underneath the middle piece and then you add in hair to the last piece and then you put it in the middle. So basically you're doing a normal braid but instead of putting the strands of hair on top of one another, you put them below one another and as you go along, you add in more hair. Continue braiding until you reach the back of your head. And when you do, gather up all the hair and secure it with an elastic. You can also pull out pieces of the braid to make it bigger and cuter. And there you have it, that's the final look for hairstyle number one. Number 2 Take one strand of hair from each side of the head and secure it with an elastic. Then you create a twist by taking the ponytail, moving it upwards and turning it into the two strands of hair and then pulling the ponytail so it becomes tight and secure. This can be a cute hairstyle as well, but we're going to create a 3 strand braid. Take the first piece, put it over the middle section, then after that take the last and put it over the middle section. Then we're going to repeat these steps until we finish braiding to the end. When you reach the end of the braid, secure it with an elastic and as usual, pull out pieces of your braid to make it bigger. Voila, this is the final look. Number 3 Just like the second hairstyle, you take one strand of hair from the side of your head and then another strand of hair from the other side of your head and then take an elastic and, and tie the two strands of hair together and then you make a twist by putting this ponytail into the inside of your head so you create a cute twist and then make sure you tighten the hair by pulling it. After that, you take two strands of hair from each side of the head directly below the strands you've taken just now and tie them with an elastic. Then you are going to push the ponytail upwards and into the two strands of hair like you did in the first step. So you take out all the remaining hair and then tie it into a big ponytail and then what you do is make a hole and slip the whole ponytail into the hole and then make sure that you uh, squeeze the ponytail to make it tight, the twist and then you can fluff out the twist if you want to Number 4 Take a big strand of hair from the top of your head and then start French braiding. So French braiding is the opposite of a Dutch braid. What you do is you take 3 strands of hair and then the first strand of hair you put it over the middle one then the third 
strand of hair, you put it over the middle one, which was the initially the first strand. So you continue doing the same process, but you have to add hair at the side of the braid. So add hair to the side of the strand and then put it over the middle. Put it over the middle, add in hair. Okay, so when you reach to the end, whereby you have add all the remaining hair, you can divide the whole hair into two strands. And then we're gonna start a fishtail. You take from this big strand of hair, you take a small strand and you cross it to the opposite strand. Then you take another small strand and you cross it over to the opposite strand. Can you see it? One small strand over opposite strand, one small strand over opposite strand. So continue the same pattern. Continue braiding until you reach the end of your hair. After that, secure it with an elastic. You can pull out pieces of your braid to make it bigger and fluffier. This is the final product. Number 5. For this hairstyle, we're going to start by center parting your hair and dividing it into two sections. I'm going to do a French braid, which was the previous braid I did on this side. So you take a strand of hair, you divide it into three pieces, and then you put the first strand over the middle one, and then the third strand over the middle one. So I'll repeat, first strand over the middle one, add in hair. And then the third strand over the middle one and in here. Continue braiding until you reach the end. And then, as usual, secure your braid with an elastic. Do the same to the other section of your hair. Do a French braid all the way down. So actually, it can be a type of hairstyle by itself, this, but I will just combine it. How do I combine it? So I'll take out the elastic, and then I will combine it into one ponytail, and I will divide the whole hair into three strands. So after you divide it into three strands, you do a normal braid. French braid all the way down. After that, secure it with an elastic. Pull up pieces of your braid. And there, you're done! This is the final product. Okay, so thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed watching the hairstyles and leave a comment down below on which hairstyle do you like the most don't forget to follow Kylie on Instagram on her hair account yeah you can follow me as well till next time bye, bye.